What's up, everybody? Shimmer Gaming here, playing some NHL 17. Some more huts for you guys, and this is another Division One matchup. And this game, I actually had just played this guy right before this game, and I ended up beating him like four to nothing in a rage quit. And this game was just out of control. I can't believe the ending. It was pretty amazing. I hope you guys enjoy. So but halfway through the first period, this guy has the puck. He tries to bring it in, passes it off his own player's skate, but that guy is magically able to kick it up from a skate to a stick. He gets the breakaway and scores. He's up one nothing. A little while later in the first period, this guy is able to get around me, but on a save that I've seen Wa make so many times, he just misses completely. Now he's up by two. In the second period, another defensive breakdown. This guy gets another breakaway and scores and it's three nothing. I'm really starting to get pissed off because my team is just not breaking through this guy. And then, again, this guy scores goals like this where I poke it off his stick, he regains it, shoots it, and my defenseman decides, you know what, I'm just going to put it in my own net. He's up by four goals. I'm down 4 nothing. I'm really getting frustrated. My team is just not getting anything going. And this guy just seems to have the puck attached to his stick. And I finally get the puck going. On a broken play, we're able to get it over to Pavelski, and he actually hits the net for once, unlike anybody else, and scores. Into the third period, it takes a long time to finally get past this guy. Ekman Larson makes a nice play, taking it away from him, finds Duchesne. Duchesne goes right around the guy, gets the breakaway, forehand, backhand, and he scores. Now it's a two-goal game, but still, we have 11 minutes to go. We still have to get two there to tie it. But just a couple minutes later, they make a pass, and Duchesne picks it off, gets the breakaway, but he's tripped, and he's awarded a penalty shot. And on the penalty shot, this guy is just standing there in the net, not even moving, stiff as a board. I know, all you gotta do is shoot stick side. Duchesne does and scores. It is a one-goal game, and in the final seconds of the game, I'm trying to get something going. Buke misses an easy shot, and then Weber is changing. I don't know why you'd be changing with 20 seconds left. It is so dumb. Make a stupid play. They get to break away, and Wa completely robs the guy. I couldn't believe it. And this guy gets it. Barzel, the new pickup, strips this guy of the puck. Toe drag, scores on the breakaway. 3.2 seconds left. Ties the game. Wa making that amazing save, and then Barzel coming up clutch. Tying the game with 3.2 seconds. I could not believe this. He looked to be cherry picking in behind the defense, and it worked. He found himself on a breakaway. Montreal's accelerating. And in overtime, this guy comes in one on one with Suter, and Suter's able to poke it off of him and go the other way. Two on two. This guy comes in, misses a hit for no reason. Suter finds Barzel on the other side. He takes the one-timer and scores his second of the game. The tying and winning goal in overtime. Barzel, one of his first couple of games, I think it was like his third game on the team. Definitely buy him if you can. He's super fast, great shot. And he really saved my ass, including Wall with that spectacular save. And then Barzel just winning the game pretty much all on his own. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Enjoy the outcome. I honestly couldn't believe it. By the time this guy had four goals on me, I was I was getting ready to just quit the game. But, you know, there it goes the show. You can come back from anything. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you for watching. Remember to like and subscribe. And I'll talk to you all later.